it's my passionate belief that every rational thinker in Nigeria is aware about the level of decay in the grassroots governance, particularly in this country, which we are living in. Uh, this conference is an annual event organized by the Foreign Minister of Special Rules and Governmental and was a clear cut vision of ensuring that local governance, as you see in the theme of the conference, the, how to improve on the grassroots governance and how local governments should be proactive in dealing with issues that relate to grassroots governance. So, to my understanding, this conference is very key and is timely. And the Honorable Minister has done things rightly because as we are living now, we need to be actually moving as an entity, as a polity, as an institution. Local government need to move in like the way other local governments in the rest of the world are moving. Okay, yes, of course, you are rightly to inform you, the Minister said it correctly, that local governments are supposed to operate at a frequency of openness and transparent level. And uh, the key issue here, the issue of autonomy. When local governments are autonomous by virtue of their operations, they will be able to discharge their constitutional right as enshrined in the 1999 Constitution of the group, as we categorically stated there. So by allowing the local government to be autonomous, that will enable the local government to function effectively and efficiently as required by law. Sir, most of the local uh, sometimes I disagree with you. They are not deserted per se. Of course, you operate when there is something to operate. Local government, that we, that we, all, we all know the four funding attitudes of local governance actually create this enabling environment. Because when there is no funds in the local, when there is supposed to funds, how do you think a local government chairman will sit down in a local government on an empty treasury? How can he get up with the exigencies and the need of a common man? So by sitting down in an office, he merely just moving a chair with no cobble or no any penny because somebody will come. You know, as the Honorable Minister has said, the common man knows local government chairman. The common man takes his issues and grievances to the local government chairman. Now, if the local government is financially weak, how can the chairman sit down with us? And absolutely, when the chairman is not a seat, virtually the place becomes that not only in the north, it has been virtually everywhere in this part of the country. Thank you. I am the national president, national program for health administration in Nigeria.